Palette to Palette is an event that will take place Thursday, March 8th at the Oro O'Keefe Museum of Art. Chef Robert St. John and artist Wyatt Waters will be promoting their fourth cookbook, A Mississippi Palette, Heritage Cuisine in Watercolors of Home. At this charity event, students from Gulfport High School's culinary and media arts programs will be volunteering their talents and time to assist in plating and serving the food and providing audiovisual services. Recently, Chef Robert St. John visited Gulfport High School to meet with the culinary students and show them what types of dishes they will be serving for the event. This was an incredible experience for students to learn from a professional in the field that they might want to go into in the future. What I see received from this experience was that you should never give up. Like just because a couple of things in your life not going as planned, that don't mean you just stop and give up and like basically no hope. And, like you just keep on pushing and eventually some good gonna come to you. GHS culinary students will be plating and serving a delicious five course meal at the event, featuring salad, gumbo, pascrochet crab cakes with crab stuffing, serve and turf with grits, and white chocolate bread pudding. Chef Robert has been in the restaurant business in Hattiesburg, Mississippi for almost four decades, owning several restaurants and bars including the Purple Parrot, Crescent City Grill, Mahogany Bar, Branch, Tabella, and Ed's Burger Joint. His most recent cookbook is innovative and uses traditional and contemporary Mississippi recipes along with Wyatt Waters' famed watercolors, adding to his other classics, a Southern Palette, Southern Seasons, and an Italian Palette. The event begins at 6 p.m. and ends at 9 p.m. There will be a cooking demonstration by the chef and live painting by Wyatt Waters. Tickets are $50 per person and all proceeds will be donated to the Oro O'Keefe Museum of Art. If you or anyone you know enjoys food, art, and philanthropy, you should definitely come out to support the museum, the cookbook, and Gulfport High.